never thought breakups were pretty. You told a lie, I let you go. You started the words that I completed. Hello and welcome back to our channel. I'm Colleen and this is Our Blast Life and today I am doing a clean with me. So I started off this morning just stripping all the sheets from all the uh, beds. We use only white sheets so they can all be washed together and we can wash them on hot. I'm also using the Clorox laundry sanitizer. I recently started using that and I went ahead and just put and just made my bed up and put all the pillows back on just so that it would look neat. I'll be fine by then. So I'm using my weekly cleaning checklist, which I will link in the description box below. And I'll also link up top a video where I talk about how I do that. This was actually me doing all of the weekly checklist really in one day, which is not what I normally do. Right now, I am just cleaning all of our sliding glass doors. Um, I have one of the things that I like to do every week is just dusting, cleaning mirrors, and cleaning my doors. We actually have four sliders on this house. We have three in our living area and then one in our master bedroom. So it, they really do get pretty bad, especially in pollen season, if I don't go ahead and clean them well. Now I'm working on the laundry again. Every week I like to do the laundry twice and each time I like to wash all of our clothes which usually is just two loads since we just have a family of four. And then I also like to wash our sheets twice a week and our towels at least once a week. So right now I'm putting a load of light clothes in and then I'll have a load of darks to do later on. So if you're new to our channel, welcome. My name is Colleen, like I said, and we live in Hilton Head Island, South Carolina. My channel is about homemaking and homeschooling. I have two girls, Katie, who is 16 and who is a junior in high school. And then I have Sophie, who is uh, nine years old and she's in second grade. Sophie was adopted from China about five years ago, well, really almost six years ago now. And um, so on our channel, like I said, we do homeschool content. We do um, homemaking content and we also do some adoption content so we'd love for you to subscribe if that sounds like something you'd be interested in to clean the other side of this door that goes out to our screen porch I noticed all the pollen out here and decided to try to clean some of it up it's early March but pollen season is here with a vengeance already so um, this is a table that we keep on our back porch it used to be in our homeschool room before we moved and we had a separate homeschool room and we like to do homeschool out here we also like to eat out here so I'm just gonna try to get some of this pollen up I know it'll be back the next day but um, it's good if I can to get some of it up. So I'm cleaning the chairs and the table um, while I'm out here and, um, and then I'm going to come back in and continue working on my checklist. We walk together down the streets of my home. It's been forever a long time that I've been gone. The feelings come easy as we start a new Say. Oh. 
So now I'm going to finish dusting and wiping down everything in the main living area of our home. Now I'm just going to clean out and wipe down my refrigerator. clean up the dishes from lunch and just go ahead and wipe down the counters and I also want to clean my sink. So I've really tried to pare down the, the cleaning chemicals that I use. I've been using for most of this video the Windex multi-surface cleaner and it is also a disinfectant. What I like about that, although I don't use it every time I clean because I don't always use a disinfectant, and when I don't use this I would use Thieves instead, but what I like about it is it's also a good glass cleaner, so I've been using that. Now I'm in the little bathroom. This is a half bath across from our laundry room and I'm just using Clorox wipes and then that, like the little Clorox um, toilet bowl cleaner because they're disposable. I use those in my bathrooms. Now I've moved on to our master bathroom. I'm scrubbing our marble floor tile in our shower with just some dish soap and a sponge. I like to use things that are not harsh on this marble floor. Too many days in the darkness Without a glimpse of the light Running tired and broken and scared But I swear I'll never give up the fight I see you broken and beat Head pulled down over your eyes Every part of you wants to surrender Darling, you were meant to survive 
Now I'm moving back to the laundry so I can go ahead and get the clothes folded. I like to fold them as soon as I can just so they don't get all wrinkled because I really hate ironing. So I'm just going to go ahead and fold all these. I've already moved the other clothes into the dryer and I'm just going to keep it moving as much as I can through the day. Now I'm going to go ahead and vacuum the master bedroom as well as the main living areas of the home. Friends, we'd love to pray for you. If we can pray for you, let us know in the comments below. We're always happy to pray for any prayer needs that you have, and I believe that others in this community would be happy to pray for you as well. Now I'm using my shark steam mop just to go ahead and clean and disinfect my floors.
thank you for being here today, friends. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Bye!